call Mo. Yeah. 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 Oh, she gone? Oh, there she gone. <laughs> All good. Yeah, this is gonna be good. All right. Nice. It's actually a good idea. There you go. Yeah. All right, here we go. Jeff, you win, baby? You got enough space? I'm good. You good? All right, man. All right, we got a three-man team here. We got we got my man, uh, we got Jeff Gregory. Say hello, Jeff. What's happening, everybody? All right, we got my man, Double P. See, I'm at a disadvantage. I'm next to you tall guys. Let's go over the booth and rail. I'm and looking at the TV. Like, well, we started, huh? Well, here We're they starting. Go. All right. And uh, all of them in the need of a break. Log. I don't know about you guys, but these tables are playing snug. Yes. Super tight. Let's see if these Filipinos play them tight or not. What's wild is that the cloth is new on these tables. Right. And in about six months, I'm curious to see how they're going to play that. Oh, yeah. It's going to be super tight. Balls are going to be hanging. Like yeah. crazy. This guy looks a little. I think he's a local guy here. That's Oliver Mendonia, right? Where's oh. Oliver from? You guys know Oh, from? that's Philippines, brother. They're just practicing yeah. still. Okay, gotcha. Gotcha. Yeah. Gotcha. Yeah. Yeah. They're, they're, they're from the Philippines. Deep. So, what was the score of the Mika in the Oscar match? 9 7? Yeah, something like that. 9 7. Oscar uh, just kind of test. test Nika's number, man. I don't know yeah. what it is about that. Yep. Everybody's talking about that back in the stands. Yeah. yeah. Nika just doesn't play the same way he plays against people who he would normally Oscar just beat. Oscar just oh. he got the gear to just slow him down. Oscar, yeah, he's a grinder. Yeah, he slows him yeah, down. His, his, you know, I remember playing Oscar 10 years ago in San Francisco. And Amar and Tony Chohan were always, every single six months they come and they match up. And usually Amar and Tony would get all their cash every, every six months, man. Then Oscar went and had surgery, LASIK surgery. Yeah. And as soon as he had that surgery, I remember how good he started playing, and he started beating Amar. And then he started asking Amar to play, and Amar was like, "Well, I, I don't know if I like it." <laughs> right? Because That's I was. Strong as that. I, I, don't was like, I don't like giving my money away. And, and then Oscar started discovering Whole Foods. Uh huh. Started That's going right. going off at Whole Foods Market, eating good. Yeah. I don't know if he wanted it just for a workout, but yeah. being here for 14 hours is definitely a workout. And Absolutely. Right. And you better have the proper nutrition. Yeah, I think that's why he goes to Whole Foods. Yeah. He's smart, man. Mm hmm. Train like a champion, play like a champion. That's right. That's right. A lot of guys talk about doing it, but he's actually doing it. Yes, you're exactly right. Now, didn't Oliver and uh, Raymond win the 10 ball uh, world champions? Yeah. The Oliver partners? Raymond. Yeah, the partners. Yeah, so. Is that right? All yeah. yeah. And this, this guy. Yeah. Yeah. And Raymond. And Raymond. Um, yeah. And Raymond. Uh, Raymond and, um, yeah. So Oliver is from the Philippines. Yeah. Yes. All three of them. I, I found together. out that Jeffrey is going to be here till August 18th, and he goes back to the Philippines, and he comes back again in October. Yeah. So uh, I think he's got family back there as well. All right. We got action. They're lagging. Uh, Jeffrey Ignacio versus Oliver Mendenio. It's going to be a good match. Looks like uh, and, uh, Jeffrey gets the lag. Right. Wow, it's tight. You guys, it's alternate break, man. Come on. Well, wow. there you go. <laughs> I like <laughs> I how they figured that out. Yeah, yeah. that's, that's very balls. cool. That's very cool. There's no, no, no chance. That took 10 chance. seconds. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> I'd still be out there. No, I don't mind closer. Phil <laughs> Brent just messing with me. Gave my lemon? super long says, Yeah, it's a lemon. We changed up. We had cherry yes, yesterday. Nice. All right, I'm interested to see how uh, Jeffrey's going to break. You no, know, it's interesting. Did you guys get a chance to watch what Corey was doing? Yeah. Corey was breaking from the rail, yeah. using a bridge from the rail, using his jump cue, yeah. and jumping onto the one. <laughs> okay. Say it one more time. He was what? He was yeah. bridging from the rail. Okay. So his he was making a closed bridge on the rail, right. using his jump cue and landing on the one. He was doing a jump shot. Why would he do that? It was making those two balls. It was working. Yeah. It was working. Wow. 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 He made them two balls inside like butter. Yeah. All right. Tough layout He's right in the door, Ron. He is.
So these three Filipinos, Raymond, right. Oliver, and Jeffrey, they must be traveling together, yeah, I'm guessing. Yeah, they are. I just like to see these guys at weekly tournament yeah. show up out of nowhere. <laughs> you want to play kinda, some? That's kind of how it was when Santos came to town years ago, came to California. His name was Sonny. It wasn't Santos, it was Sonny. He played everybody and beat them all. Wow. He plays good, Santos. Still does. Looks like we lost our talent. Wow. Looks like we lost the chat. I'm trying to get it up. Beautiful hit. Uh, well, uh, Oliver has an open shot on the one ball. Just don't know where his shape's going to be on the two, but he has an open shot. I think he's going to play in the side pocket. Okay. So Play to hit the four. Play, play to right into the four ball. Yeah. It's impossible. Delicate shot, man. Well, it's the most time I've seen him take all day, so. These guys are very deliberate. That's nice about the game. Oh, yeah. Scratch. Yeah. Well. Yeah. You know, that was a difficult position he was playing anyway. It was tough. It was tough. Yeah. Hey, Raw, have you hit any balls in these tables yet? No. No, you should. You should. I wish you did because I was going to ask you how they compare to, like, say, the tables down in rooms down in LA. Right. Like, I give it a try before we go. San Diego, like, uh, on cue? Yeah. How those tables play down there? Loose. Yeah. Are they? Yeah, they're loose and it's, yeah. They got a couple. They got, they got two, a couple, right? two, two tight ones. Two, maybe three. Three tights, but they're looser than these. These are, these are brutal. What hard times in, in the Bellflower? Those are brutal. But Sacramento, yeah. man, you guys tip is tight over there. used to be worse, but they fixed them now. Yeah. Those are tight. They were, they were just ridiculously just tight. spitting balls out, like one yeah. pocket tournament style. Yeah, they had a uh, the B players. Used to get 25 players a week, and it went down to 10 after the tables got tight because nobody could make three or four balls. I mean, yeah. They just stopped playing. Yeah, so it's not fun when you can't run any balls. Yeah. It was a creative yeah. shot by Jeffrey, but yeah. he didn't quite bump the nine out as far as he wanted to. Here comes some funky inside juice. Yeah, that's right. Philly juice, right? Right, that's how you do it. Uh, I, don't know if he can, I don't know if he can get that much. Uh, here comes the funky angle. juice. Here you come. <laughs> here comes the funky juice. What were you saying, Phil? Oh, I guess so. <laughs> <laughs> that must be that bullet-shaped uh, <laughs> Jeff, did tip you get to see Ignacio's tip? No, I did not. When you, oh, man. When you get a chance to look at it, it's literally like a sphere. It is a sphere. It's like half dome. Really? Oh, I see it now. Huh. Well, these guys like to juice up the ball. Put a lot of English in the ball, huh? He juices the ball supremely. Yeah. Well, we just saw that free ball he caught back in the four. That was pretty sweet. This guy's loved around here, man. He's got a lot of fans. Yeah. I've seen three people say, ask him to buy him lunch and dinner, and I don't think he's bought a meal since he's been here. No. 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 They got it covered. They were the same at the. Uh, and he's a he, he's a very friendly, personal yes. guy yeah. too. Yeah, First time nice I guy. met him was at Reno Bar Table Championships last year, mm -hmm. and Jay Hartfield had brought him a plate of food, mm -hmm. and he was trying to give me food. He, he I was sitting there talking to him, and he. He just wanted me to eat with him. Yeah, he's yeah. very, uh, very yeah, humble. He's humble. Yeah. Look at that. Well, um, just shoot you know, when you're co-signed by Bustamante and Efren as the next, then you know something's good. Future world champion here. Absolutely. And that's how you get out, ladies and gentlemen. Nice job. Just like that. We have Jeffrey Ignacio takes the first game. There we are. You are watching the Mez West State Tour, stop number six in Milpitas, California at Edgy's Billiards. In the booth we have the illustrious Jeff Gregory. You know guys, I was talking to Desiree earlier about <clears throat> trying to get some corporate sponsors to add some money to make this tournament pay, you know, someday five, ten, right. fifteen thousand dollars right. each stop. Right. And we were talking about who who could sponsor, who would sponsor it. 
and she was talking about like a beer company. She was talking about uh, like uh, the small brewing companies. Are, right. These guys, corporations, are making millions of dollars. They they need write-offs. Right. So, they need. Uh, we just need somebody to approach these guys. Yeah, that's not a so bad idea. If you idea. guys know any uh, corporate sponsors, any possibilities? That's right. There's got to be somebody out there that uh, can get it started. So that's all it needs is a break. I said, it says, pool is not dead. Pool is not dead. No. All right, we're going to see this guy out of a break. Yeah. Filipinos sound like the best hand bridges ever in life, man. These yeah, guys, oh, they, yeah. This guy's they like mean, a spider. Yeah. yeah. Like different variations of a spider bridge. Have you seen these guys? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Just I, wicked, man. Made <laughs> you watch Danny Petrava's bridge, like all four fingers just collapsed yeah, on each other. Right. Like the hand's been broken multiple yeah. times or something. Yeah. They bend them in every different direction. Maybe that's their secret. Maybe they just break their hands. What's your hand, Phil? Come here. <laughs> yeah, it's like, mm. I don't know. Something about it. He makes a ball, but no shot on the one. Yeah. He's looking to see where he's going to push out. Yeah, you, you have to push out to a safety here. these guys are, Jeffrey and, uh, and Oliver. Anybody know how old they are? Um, I know that the Raymond guy is 27. Yeah. Okay. I think Jeffrey's younger. Yeah. 21, 22? Don't uh, let that baby face fool you. He's oh, got to no. be older now. He's got a couple of kids at home, I think. I think yeah, I th I'd say maybe he's 25, 26. <laughs> That's what I was thinking. Oh, he uh, got shot. Yeah. yeah. He didn't get through that ball how he usually does. Table number 22, Jason Williams and Raymond. Raymond and Jason, table 22. I think if you're going to make a mistake like that, make Jason it early. Goes to eight, right. goes Let the man to earn nine. it and run out. Get your oh, it falls. The ball won't fall in three weeks from now. Mm. Um, Paul Silva had a chance to beat this all. Is that right? Yeah. You know, he, he, he struggled, though. Oliver was yeah. struggling that way. Yeah, he had a lot of yeah. ropes. Wow. Here we go, looking like two rails back to the three. Nice shot. Nice shot. Well, guys, I'm going to predict uh, if he gets on the spine ball, he's going to be out. All right. I see him getting out here. I'm going to predict he's going to run out. There you go. He's on line. Stop, stop, draw back. Five well, of the seven is going to be the key shot in this game. Yeah. As well, long as these guys stay on the line, eh? Very dangerous to get out. He's stretching here, though. He, like, he puts that foot up easy, Phil. Man. Wow. Mm -hmm. uh, this is his key shot. Five to seven right here. He's got the angle. He's got yeah, two rails right does. to the seven. Yeah. Gonna fade the side or just one rail, one long right, rail. one rail. Is draw down. Yeah, you're right, Ron. Two rails in one. You know, that's because you guys both shoot better than me. I, I go the easy way. <laughs> I hey, go the easy coach, way. Can I give you a call? <laughs> yeah, man, I'll tell you. It's good as you. Especially how you shoot. But, uh, you know, just do the do kiss. Keep it simple. Sure. That's all I can do is simple. You can do all that fancy stuff. I think he got a little bit straight in this ball. Yeah, he should be okay. Though. Yeah. He, 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 he might have an angle to go, go to the rail and out. I think he's going to have to draw it back, man. Yep. There he goes. He can't follow it, he's going to hit the 10. Right. This is a good shot to practice. A lot of guys should practice that shot. It comes up a lot. Yeah. I, I see a lot of guys miss that simple shot. Right. They think, how did I miss that? It's a tough shot, Jack, though. Yeah. And I didn't start shooting that shot, so I saw both shoot it like 50 million times. Yeah, they practice it for a reason. Yeah, right? he gets wrong, and he just yokes it back and forth. These guys can play a little bit. Man. Oh, yeah. This is going to be a speedy match. We're going to have to... <laughs> Time it. We're going to have to stay on board, man. Well, we, between we got, Rodney. I mean, Rodney's the fastest oh, boy I've ever seen like play. Absolutely. One it's, it's one apiece. And uh, you're watching the Mads West State Tour. This is uh, Ra Hanna with Phil Prentice and Jeff Gregory. Remember, if you want to try out any of the Mez Qs, make your way down to a Mez Q stop and ask to use the demo queue. You know, Phil, you got a hell of a pool collection, man, a Q collection. I've seen you with that sweet Ed Pruitt queue you had. I, yes. I love that queue. And you've had a, others, you got a Southwest. A what do you Southwest. like so much about the Mez? What do you like about it the most? Well, I like, what, what I really like about the Mez is the shaft. 
shaft. Love the WX900 shaft. Yeah. And I was preparing for the BCA Nationals in Vegas. I didn't really want to travel with my expensive cues. And it's really easy for me to take my shaft and pop it on my, my Pruitt, my Sugar Tree, and it plays almost identical. Yeah. So, so they're just good uh, good shafts. And Oscar got me playing with a mesh shaft too. He was he was showing me why. And he's he put a he put an eight ball in the jaws of the pocket. And he put the cue ball in the middle of the table. And he said, "Now make this ball and draw back with the predator, right?" And uh, he said, "Now do it with your predator." And I did. Can't and draw I hit straight. the side rail. Uh, the very first time I tried it, but on the mesh it came straight back. Uh -huh. I was like, well, "That's why I use a mesh." I was like, "Ah, oh, okay." Mm -hmm. Yeah. Sense. So uh, he made me a believer. Oscar's you know, Mez was a very scientific a, guy. Mez has been making cues for over 50 years. Yep. And yeah. I found out that, talking to Mika today, he was telling me that uh, Mez made a bad business deal with an American businessman. Mez made cues for Mally, Helmstetter, um, one of the cue makers, I forgot who it was, but. Adam? Adams, that's it. I had no idea. I didn't know until today, I had no idea. So all those old Adams cues are actually made by Mez. Yes. Wow. Did you guys know that? I did not. No. Yeah. Mika told me all about it, man. I like Mika's line in those meds. There's some beautiful cues in there. True. Mika's yeah, line? Sweet. Oh, sweet. He said he's going to come out with a Mika number four coming out here in like another six months. Wow. MI4. Wow. Because the MI3 is beautiful. The way he plays yeah. now. It's gorgeous. Oh, yeah, it's nice. Yeah. All right, uh, Nancio just has to hold this line on his three ball and shoot right up to the four. Like a hanger. Come on. Yeah, that was just We're beautiful. playing on three and seven eight inch pockets here. I know. You just hit that. You know, when he's, he just gets right down to it. Head is lined, shoulders line, elbows line. He's just on it. You know, he just makes straight. it look easy. Yeah, he does. Well, he's got a little tester here, okay? Let's see what he does. Follow it. Punch it over. Just like that. Stun shot. That was man. a great shot. That was, man. Look at that control, man. Right <laughs> you there. know what I mean? It's like, Pop, stop. we know these shots are hard. And people watching know these shots are hard. Especially pool players. But he just hits them like it's a hanger. He makes it look easy. One thing I was talking to these guys earlier about the, the playing conditions. Because when they play in the Philippines, it's real humid out there. Right. And there's only a few indoor pool halls. But a lot of pool halls are... Outside. They're covered, but they're outside, and they're right. humid, they're humid, humid. These guys are liking these playing conditions. They can, I mean, it's, it's top quality. He goes to the side rail here. Yeah, I side think so. rail. They just have, they just have a, 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 a swagger style about them that's just beautiful yeah. to watch. It is. Wow. Every ball is going center pocket. Two, one, exactly. It's awesome. I'd like to thank one of our sponsors, Fast and Loose Designs. Fast and Loose Designs, sponsored by Mr. Chris Santana. If you need any designs, graphics, websites, banners, badges, Chris Santana does it all. Fast and loose. He does. He does it fast and loose. Yeah. He's and cheap. Tight and cheap. Now. Yes, now. So exactly. Catch him, catch him early. Exactly. Yeah, before he blows up. Before he blows up. They're going up. Chris has been playing billiards for about eight hours yesterday. Did you see him? Wow. He couldn't get off that table, man. He was just. He uh, loves billiards. Oh, yeah. And he's got some nice nice billiard tables here at Edgy's. Oh, they have them Chevrolet. 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 Whatever. They play good. Rolls Royce tables. Backswing hit him right in the nose. That was yeah, he did. Ball straight. You know, Shane's had the best 10 ball break for a long time, but a lot of people were starting copying to catch it, it up. Yeah. And they're copying his break and they're figuring it out. Yeah. A lot of good breakers out there. Right? Yeah. Yeah, no doubt. But the original. I'm going to try Corey Duell's break, though. That sounds like what you're talking about. Really right? strong, man. There's a jump cue. That's what he was doing. Yeah, got to avoid that. He got away He's with still, it. He got away Looking to see if he has that three in the side pocket. Nice. 
Nice. Floated right up. I don't think that three ball goes by the five, but I could be wrong. Well, he's looking at it like it does. It must. No, he called a side pocket. Inside. Did he? Yeah, it doesn't go by the five. Well, the key ball's going to be let loose here. Yeah, yeah he, he don't let, like it. He's going to run, trying to get right back between the six and the ten here. So it's it's inside it. English? Yep, inside English. Oh, well. oh yeah, that's, that's a, a tough shot. shot if it makes it, he's going to probably get out, but... I'm going to say Jeffrey's going to get out. Yeah. This guy is playing sporty. He just gets up. Wipes his shaft down. <laughs> it's like time to go to work. All right. I wonder who taught Jeffrey how to actually play pool. Does he have a coach? Does he have a... Got to be a mentor or someone thing, in the Philippines. Yeah. One thing I know, one of my friends just told me that. He's got the cosign from the Masters. And wow, he's really? the next. Yep. Wow. That's what I heard. Next in line for the crown. Is that right? That's that's pretty oh, impressive. Right there. Right? That's yeah. impressive, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, if you talk about it, I had half heard people say this guy's the future world champion. Yeah. I'm telling you, the Philippine people I told said he is who's the next. Curious. We still have Corey Dole's DVDs <laughs> up here. Throughout his back. Uh oh. Eight ball, nine ball, one pocket. And the basics, one for 30, the whole set for 100, and Corey's here. You want any pointers? Come check it out. There's not too many left. He is a mess. Yeah, he's back a little. He like tweaked it a little. Tweaked it a little bit. <coughs> Let me oh, adjust it. Fight through it. Yeah. He's got youth on his side. Yeah. yeah. It's like, it's like, it hurts a little bit. Me, I might just, I might be sitting down. I'll be enjoying my cue. <laughs> Two Advils and a cup of coffee, please. Mm-hmm. It's like, <laughs> I'm just firing away. He made like pain look graceful. <laughs> exactly. We'd like to thank our sponsor, Andy Cloth. Andy Billiard Cloth. Check him out at andycloth.com, the official cloth sponsor of the Mez West State Tour. Have you had a chance to uh, play on Andy Cloth before? In heart of the heart is, uh, I want to try it. Nice. Yeah. I'd like to try it too. When my table is ready to be covered at home, I think I'm going to try Andy Cloth. There you go. Nice, man. Yeah, yeah sure. Roddy was talking about it earlier. He was talking about yeah. how uh, it plays the same. Right when you put it on the table, there's no not much slipping around. And that's a good thing. But it's funny. I've kind of got used to the slip and slide. Slip and slide, of, slide right? Yeah. And you get on there and it doesn't do it, you're going to miss it. Well, I'm curious to see what the Noxio is going to do on this break. Hits it with a little more power or he just squats and rocks. Right. He's going to probably be. Yeah, he's more reserved there. He didn't yeah. put a lot of power nope. into it. He just, just cinched it. Just cinched it. Cinched break. Eight ball, no. When he, yeah, releases, he, when he releases the cue, he's got a, like a similar release like Bustamani, like a young Bustamani. Right. Yes. It's kind yeah. of reminds me of. Yeah. On the break or? or no, I'm talking just about just, just regular right. shots. Just regular shots. Yeah, yeah. 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 he's exactly right. Cause it's like and almost smooch. like he, he has a little wrist action and he kind of yeah. just throws the stick. Yeah, yeah. Like yeah. yeah. It. It's impressive though, I'll tell you what. I've tried it. It's hard. It's these, guys, these guys <laughs> won the mini tournament in the Philippines? Yeah, so? doubles. That must have been a nice little payday. Yeah. I like how I played that shot right That there. was he, nice. He I was just looking at exactly where he wanted yeah. to get and just held it up with inside. The thing I like, these guys just... They just get right down to business, man. Got a nice, fast pace, nice rhythm going. Well, they're definitely drawing the biggest crowd, I'll tell you what. Absolutely. Uh, it's a standing room only over here. I don't see any problems here. Uh, no, we're looking at three zeros on top of these balls. Yeah. Automatic pilot right here. It's just quick too. Yeah. You know, I heard a, a 
the story they were talking about Bucktooth last night, how Bucktooth always used to come around to all these championships and, you know, bark at all these champions to get down and play. And uh, he's still around, man. Last yeah. night he was right down the road at Crown Billiards. Wow. Good way to get there. You make sure you're gonna get. You're not gonna come too long or too short. Use the rail. Yeah. And he has a little bit of a slip, so he slips back, 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 back. He finds a spot and then goes for. Nice out. Yeah, nice out. out. Three to two. Uh, we're gonna have to keep up on this. I'd like to thank um, Contact Point Media, responsible for the live stream and the live scoring app. If you want to license this product, please contact Desiree Rivera or Oscar Dominguez. Contact point media. Some scores around the room. We have uh, uh, Brian Parks. Brian Parks defeated Mika Eminem nine to seven. Yeah, um, I'm not really sure why Brian uh, is, is still an eight. The guy plays flawless, man. You know what, Jeff? I, I'll attest to that. When he's been playing, he's not. I haven't seen him play up to his full potential huh. yet. Yeah. I mean, he he he'll hit a couple balls, brilliant. And then he won't get there. Yeah. And I told him, I had him in the booth. And I said, man, I'm looking for you to break out. He's a uh, he's solid. So I mean, two-time ABA champ. You know, he's a beast. He's a beast. But it's, you know, it's got to translate to the game. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And we're all been. Well, waiting he's a family for him. man. He's got a lot going yeah, on. Yeah, he's got a couple business. businesses. Yeah, and he's an awesome guy. Oh, he's a good he'll, he'll tell you himself. I told him. I said, man, I'm, I'm waiting. I'm saving a spot on the chair for you. He's got good fundamentals, man. Yes, he does. Nice smooth stroke. Smooth, yes. He got a great attitude, too. Great attitude. Yeah. We got Rodney Morris and Frank Robots tied at four apiece. Frank Robots is hanging in there. Yeah, he is. He's playing good. Yeah, he's. Uh, right? He's still in there. Oh, yeah, with Rodney. So that's what that's, that's and he, Frank's a seven, right? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Did you say Frank's a seven or Frank's yeah. seventy? Frank's a seven. Probably both. Okay, gotcha. Uh, <laughs> probably pr pushing sixty, but you know what, man? I remember Frank from a couple years ago. He he was uh, 100, 100 pounds heavy. He lost over hundred pounds. Oh, really? Wow, go for him. And uh, he's living life, man. That's looking good. There you go. Oh, still oh. hanging. Oh, Rodney just missed a straight in timbal. Up to the camera wow. there. Watch this guy's backswing though, he's breaking. Yeah. This guy's sweet backswing. <laughs> Ow! That's wow. a great looking break right yeah, there. Yeah, he, he breaks with a little bit of side arm, huh? Yeah, yeah. a little bit. <coughs> but that's a, that's a world class break right that's there. That's perfect. Take that in a bottle any day, man. Absolutely. You're like, can I take two of those, please? Everybody has a one railer down to the two. Yeah. Alright, looking at two. I'm making sure the nine goes. Phil, I would love to be able to take a like a two month vacation to the Philippines. Oh, okay. Just play pool and, and uh, just work my pool game and get to play as champions. Yeah, I was for talking a few pesos. to I was talking to Oscar about that. He he was saying that the country to go to would be China. China, huh? Huh. I guess, yeah, Oscar did say the Chinese are taking over, man. He said he played some people. He played this guy, and a guy playing even or something like that. Or, or Oscar was giving the guy something. And, and Dennis Okulo comes in, and the guy's playing Dennis even for money. Really? Yeah. And Oscar was playing them, getting heisted. That's amazing, man, yeah. Yeah. Oscar, Oscar said that show cost him only about eight thousand. Yeah, it, it, it helped him get about a half ball better. While playing down there, realize right? how hard these guys play for fifty and twenty, fifty, a hundred bucks. Hundred dollars to them is a big, big, big set. Absolutely. Yeah, and they'll, they'll, I mean, they give it their all. Absolutely. Yeah, that was a nice shot there. Played off the I think he wanted to go up a little bit more, but he's okay because the six balls bought a hole. Yeah. 
He's going to have a long shot of six after this shot, I'm pretty sure. He's going to juice it back to the rail. Like, oh, wow. And yeah, that's true. <laughs> Damn. You know what? And I they say it's because shot. these guys play on those tables. It's, you know, they human. play on the super slow human tables. They build these strokes. Now they get on some yeah. optimal equipment there, just put that ball wherever yeah. they want. These guys all have killer strokes. I like how this guy comes through the ball, man. He I'm, comes through I'm the ball. I'm going to say, this guy hits balls pretty um, strong. Well, I think he's warming up a little bit. Yeah, I don't know, man. He plays pretty solid. Kind of reminds me of Ricola a little bit. Dennis Ricola. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. This, he he's might be, scaring you a little. Yeah, he might be. I don't know. <laughs> he's scarier? Yeah, he's scary. I don't Are we sure that Ignacio's better than this guy? Flip a coin. I don't know. Right? I don't know, man. This guy looks pretty dialed in. I think you can take him in a foot race, Phil. <laughs> I don't know about that. I might lose that one, too. Oh, man. All right. Tied up 3 3. Wow. The Mez West State Tour stop number six, Edgy's Billiards in Milpitas, California. I'd like to take this time to thank our sponsor, Pius. Pius. Excellence ball cleaner and shirt. His ball cleaner that's coming out is supposed to be one of the best products on the market. He's also done donated a ton of shirts in support of Chris Robinson. What a great thing to do. Yeah, I actually got a sample from Oscar of the excellent ball polisher. Haven't got to try it yet, but uh, my balls need to be washed. Yes, yeah, we're going to do. That's what I'm going to do. Yeah, because I, I, I heard there's no residue on it. That's a good break. Look at that that's break. It. Another world that's class the, break. That's the shame. Oh, the squat one ball going in and hung up. Three balls got in. Three. Last ball rolling. <laughs> <laughs> but he's got no shot. Look at his face. He's like, uh, very stoic. He's like, yeah, I don't have a shot, but I'll just kick the same three rails to your eye. Six, Plain seven, safe. eight, no matter. I run out anyways. <laughs> kick Caprica safe. said that one time. One rail. Get you some. <laughs> Get you some. Put that in a bottle and take it home with you. I like that. I like that shot. He can see the edge of the three and one, but in a lot of distance, he can see about the half the ball. Is that uh, ten ball? Does it throw in the side pocket? No, the two's in the way. Doesn't have the angle for it. What's he gonna do here, guys? He's, He's calling, calling the ten, ten in the wow. side. I don't. What are you going to do here? Maybe he's just uh, got a big imagination. He's going to warn the side, warn the side up to two. Or just the one rail side. Yeah. Uh, just in case, right? I think Jeff's going to play safe here. Lock him up right behind that two and the six. Yep. If, uh, if, he's no sh if there's no shot. I was talking to him earlier and he was saying that Sometimes he plays safe, but usually he he just likes to run out. Yeah, that's what he said. That was crazy. <laughs> like, how do you play? Well, sometimes I play safe, and uh, other time I just run out. <laughs> that's got to be funny. Yeah, you called it. Good shot. I wonder if he was doing a little two-way there. Yeah. I don't think he went, but he put it. In, he put him in a tough spot. He's gonna have to do something really creative. A lot of traffic here to get this one ball. He made it too. He's calling it opposite corner. <laughs> opposite corner. He's gonna, he's gonna go two rails. He's gonna try and hit the, uh, the one ball. He's going two rails here. He's gonna try and hit the. Uh, okay, now he's changed his mind. He one called, rail. He called the one ball. He was going to try to cross bank it, right? Two originally, yeah, two it. rails. And two rail kick into a cross bank. Wow. Wow, right in the face. Yeah. Man. No good. Well, I'm not Kreskin, but uh, ball in hand <laughs> does not bode well for Mr. Oliver. How many times do you think these guys played against each other? I think it's a lot. A lot. Because they, they look like they just, you know, you see each other and they just get on there. They're here for a do a job. Man. Yeah. They're working. Absolutely. He's like, I got to feed my family. 
you're in my way. You know, what's what's sweeter than doing something you love and making money at it, man? That's what you got to appreciate. Absolutely. As much as we love pool, it's hard to make a living at it right now. That's right. I still play. Did he Change is on the rise. I think so. I think you're right, yeah. Change is on the rise. You're right. It is good to see the level of play get right. so high, That's especially right. on this uh, tour. Absolutely. Yeah. So is a spin between the five and the six? Well, how about just spin it up there between the and get right the there? You got perfect on it. How do you like that? Just enough. He got an etch a stretch. He He's going to stretch here again. See how the back's feeling now. Yeah. That's a good call, Greg. Jeff. Man. That's okay, man. Yeah. My man is Jeff Gregory, and I just keep showing him Greg. <laughs> it's Jeff. Um, that was a good call. I want to see if he is going to stretch. I don't he's know. He's out he, that bridge. Yeah, he might just bust out the bridge. We're going to find out. I like how he's thinking ahead. He's yeah. Exactly where he wants to put that ball to get on the six. Three balls and he, ahead. He takes, those, he takes the time to do it. You know, he takes the time to do it, and uh, that's a good thing because you got to be determined in Stay solid. Okay. Mm -hmm. I think he came a little short. short yeah. yeah. So this is a practice. This is this is a practice shot. He made like eight of these in a row. Yeah, he fired him. Right. Too. He just fired him in. He just put it up and put his stick out there, and the ball went in the hole. Now this, I think, he's going to shoot a little different. I think he's going to control, almost drag, with a six in the same pocket. Right, or he, he goes to that rail and comes out, or he just drifts it. He drifts it for the side pocket. How about you hit it like that? Center pocket. Not the banana. How about you hit it like that? That's just how I hit it in practice, too, right? Yeah. Oh, it's just nothing. He's still got a little funny angle here in this six ball. I don't know. I think he's going to come out and go two rails for the seven. He's going to tell you in the Philippines, this is perfect. <laughs> <laughs> I think he's going to come one rail out. He's spinning. He one rail out. Good How about shot, you man. change that ball? Man. Walks over. I'm going to chalk my hand up. I'm going to talk about that bullet tip again. That oh. Round. That's got to be a personal preference. Yeah. 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 <laughs> hey, but if he's, if he's playing that good, I'm... Huh. Man. Maybe it helps you with it. Well... I read something in Dr. Dave that the uh, surface of the ball where it hits with the tip is only in contact for a certain amount of seconds and the curvature, blah, 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 blah. Yeah. But, right? Yeah. But his is whole true. tip is round. His whole tip Everything. is round. Everything. It's like an eraser. And you, and you can't argue with the results. You know what? Now, somebody would say they could beat you to death with a flat tip. Right? Yeah, he's it, a pro, it, he it just depends on your style of play. Right. And, and well, we Jeffrey know likes style. to spin balls yes. in. Exactly. So does that help or hinder? All right. And just like that, it's four to three. Nick Jeff Ignacio. It, we have a battle. I'd like to take this time to thank SoCal Tap League. SoCal Tap in SoCal, California. Ran by Ian Brock, inventors of the runout app. Now, is Oliver taking a break here? He must be. I don't see him. Yeah, because Ignacio's just sitting there saying, hey, I'm ready. So some other scores around the room. We have uh, Raymond Ferrone, um trailing Jason Williams 3-1. to one. Jason Williams is doing his He's thing. Coming, yeah, he coming, is. coming to play. I'm glad the guy who knocked me out is still doing well. We were talking outside. He said, uh, you know, he said, I drove here. He said, I'm tired of getting beat up on the B-side. He said, I am come to play today. That's good. Jason's mentally strong, man. Yeah, that guy can get it. He's, 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 he's an skills. athlete. He's an yeah. athlete. Yeah, skills. Most definitely. Uh, Rodney Morris uh, made make a little comeback up 6 5 against Frank Robots. That's another guy hanging on in there, Frank Robots. It, to be in the just final eight, correct? Yeah. To be in the final eight That's and strong. to be a seven. Or an eight. That's You're strong. playing pool, bro. Yeah. Let's just read these names. You got Raymond Baraon from the Philippines, Mika Eminen. Oh, Mika, no, Mika's gone. Brian Parks, Rodney Morris, Jeffrey Ignacio, and Oliver Mann. That is uh, Rogues Gallery. I'd be curious to see Mr. Robot's bracket. See how, I, how many I, champions he has a run through. <laughs> well, he, he beat that uh, Eton guy. That guy plays good. Right? I don't play the play. He plays good, right? Or he's not a nine ball, not a rotation player? Not much. Not much. Okay. 
Because, you know, a lot of it does have to do with the, the draw you get. Yeah. I would say that, but did you see the winner's bracket today? Oh, man. Oh, okay. Just BC, BC, BC. BC, BC. Yeah. <laughs> Mr. Bye wasn't around today. No, not to. Well, it's not even so much the buy. I mean, you know, you know what I mean. Yeah. Getting an easy draw. Easy draw. It wasn't happening today. Oliver's back. Here he is. Frank's about to tie this game up here. Wow, that's incredible. Get that. Yeah, she's talking to Juno Morty. June's been a Filipino uh, name stay in the Bay Area for 20 years, man. Dude, I'm straight. I'm going to blow you up. Are you good? Yeah. My man Juno Monte in, in the house. Beat me up in Reno back in the day. Sneaky. Yeah. Undercover. Him and Jeff Gregory, all these <laughs> North Cal guys when I was playing out there. It's nothing but a good time. I like a knowledgeable crowd about pool, and that's what we got here today, Phil. Yes, we do. I did ask you. Frank ties it up, 6'6", six, six. he made wow. a nice out. Yeah. Frank Roberts, <laughs> he said, I'm for real. Coming to play. He said, what's up? All right, Oliver is waiting for, uh, is he waiting for Ignacio? Yeah, Ignacio putting the freeze on him a little bit. And here he comes. So what do you guys do the raffle on there? <laughs> So they're selling raffle tickets for ten dollars a piece for a yeah. Mez Q, nice Q. Yeah, nice Q. That's a good Q. And uh, so I'll, let's see if he has some success on his break. Oh, that's a consistent yeah. break. Yeah. You know what? I think that little sidearm has something to do with it. Yeah, I like it. It's a simultaneous swing. Yes. Yes. It's like up and then it's in and out from the side. I think he might throw his shoulder out or something trying to do that. Yeah. Yeah, I remember reading about George Breedlove. Oh, the Breedlove. Throwing his shoulder right out of the socket, breaking so hard. That guy works like King Kong. He still had that offer saying anybody who worked a day with him, he'll play him. Doing what really? he does. Yeah. If I was an SO, that's what I'd have too. But meanwhile, back to his man. Oliver is uh, he's a little sharpshooter, bro. Yeah, we're seeing some world class points. This is man. beautiful. Guys, I love it, you know? And it's like. Uh, the old adage, you watch Willie Moscone play, hey, look at this guy plays, plays good. He's like, that guy doesn't play good. You know, he <laughs> shot was easy shots. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> if a guy's only shooting easy shots, you forget how good he plays or how he, how he got there, right? That's right. Because I know me, I'm always shooting eight footers. He's got a little tester here, huh, in the side pocket. you're just going to cut and slice it right in and yeah, just come and right back at two rails. Side, Look at how much juice he's putting on that ball. Just like that. Short side that was there. a beautiful stroke, man. Well, I think the shot here is going to be the four of the five. It's going to be the key shot this game. Now it's going to be the three to the four. He was waiting for Rodney to shoot him. He's lining up and right through that ball. That Look nice. at that spin city, man. A little short. No, he's actually perfect. I told you in the Philippines that's perfect, Phil. That's perfect, man. Because at the stretch, he just gets down and hits the yeah. ball and just gets right where he wants to get up. Natural shape. Yeah. Just draw to the side rolling out, yep. or is he going to drag it? Side rolling out. There it is. I'm going to predict he's out now. 4-4, <laughs> folks. Wow, Ronnie just missed a real straight into my ball against robots. Did you get lucky, though? No. Yeah. Roll. If robots can make it. Can he? I think so. Yep. Well, Oliver is looking at straight down the pipe at this five ball. He's figuring I got easy lunch here. He just comes through the cue ball so well. I'm yeah, telling you, I don't know. I'm, I'm interested to see uh, the seasoning of this Oliver guy. I'm going to look him up. 
because he plays like he been there. And he knows he's playing Jeff Ignacio. You know what I mean? He's hitting these balls crisp. He got the wrong side of the seven. Now he's got a tough shot. Yeah. He got nine. So he's gonna have to recover here. See how he finishes out this rack here. Is he going to side rolling back out? Or is he yes. going down now? Okay. Yeah, good. Two. Guys are good, man. Yeah, this is this is pure fun to watch, man. It is. Man. Neck and Let's neck. Just shoot on OK Corral. All right. I'd like to thank our sponsors, Town Tips, Town Break and Jump Tips, used on tour by Rodney Morris, Mika Inman, and Oscar Duce. Dominguez, among others. Phil P. And Phil P. <laughs> Force. Well, this is billed as advertised. This is just a shootout. You make a mistake, well, you don't have to make a mistake, and they're getting out. Yeah, very well, Mel B. Who won the, the lag is going to win this set. That's right. Were these guys in Vegas? Yes. Yeah. Uh, in Vegas. Yeah, he did well, I think. Uh, it was funny because um, Bo had to play Ignacio and then Gomez back to back. Wow. He did. Yeah, they, they, they did well in the tournament. And uh, on side action, there was uh, Jeff Ignacio and uh, Warren Campo played a played? Scott played a Scotch doubles eight ball match with Justin Bergman and Skylar Woodward. Who won that match? The, the young guns, the kids. Did they really? 20, guys that, 20, up to 25 to 17 or something yeah. like that. Or 25 but it's styles. To Those kids know each other's styles. They're bar box to be. Yeah. They're, I mean, they're, they're, they're tough, tough, tough on bar yeah. box. Wow. When Kiyanko beat Bergman in the race joint, I mean, they, they put a six pack, then he put a five pack, then he put another pack, and then wow. uh, he broke dry and homeboy got him. Broke out. That's amazing, man. Bar table, the great equalizer. Yeah, yeah um, I'm just going to say it. I'm not a fan. Don't send me hate mail. Bar boxes, for me, I mean, it's, it's another discipline. Toy table. It's tough. Well, I'd but, hate to say it, but uh, on this next table, Frank is uh, about to take, take the lead on Rodney. Go up 7 6. Rodney missed the five ball, and Frank's wow. about to run out. Rodney's a little out of sorts, man. I think he can pick it back up if he needs to. Well, I heard Rodney was telling me he's going to be uh, maybe relocated to Northern California. Yeah. Buying a house. Yeah. Next week in Lincoln, I think. Nice. nice lady. Yeah. You come up looking pretty. That's cool, man. Hard time yeah. Sacramento is going to be loving that. Oh, yeah. That weekly tournament just got a little bit tougher. <laughs> yeah. That's good, yeah. man. Bring it on. Uh, Mars got some competition. Man. Yeah. What happened to Billy Palmer? That guy used to win everything. Billy is, uh, yeah, he's getting older. He got a job. He's working hard. He got a family. I'm good for him. I used to love watching that guy. He was a beast. He still plays pool. He was dominating. Every time I look at Sacramento, it's hard times. One pocket, nine ball. One pocket, yeah, nine. That's it. The guy's a player. He is a player. I like to, I like Billy. I miss Billy, man. He's a he's a good man. Did he make that? No. No. Wow, he didn't. He Did missed he hang the ball, Frank. Yep. That's a good shot, man. Listen. Now he's um, calling the ten ball here. Yeah, he's it's the, big he's because the of the three, gates. right? He got, yeah, yeah. Got real first. Yeah. You play this real first, Jeff? Uh, he's gonna have to, I think. I don't yeah. know. I could be wrong. Don't, don't he back cut the I two? I think he back cut the two. Angle. Back up the two to yeah. the ten and, and kiss off the three. That's it. That's what he's doing. Ooh, Rodney scratched. And, and hung up the ten ball. He's taking his time and looking at it. How do you hit it? Wow. How do you hit it? Sporty Just shot. like that, five to four. All right, I'd like to thank our sponsor, Zan Tips. Zan Tips. It's Zan Hybrid, Zan Hybrid Max, Zan, Zan Medium, Bowling, Zan Slow, Zan, Zan This, Zan, Zan That. Slow. Shazam, Shazam. Zantips.com. Use on tour by Phil Prince. Yes. And if you're interested in one, uh, contact Oscar Dominguez. There you go. Um, Jeff, 
I mean, yeah, Jeff. Yeah. Um, I think this um, Mr. Os uh, Oliver guy might be a little better than Agnes. Well, How what you say? Well, I mean, we have, moment, man. we haven't gotten Maybe to see in this a lot moment, of, but, but overall, this, yes, it's hard to say. I know, but he just—I don't know. There's something about him. He, he doesn't look like he's an underdog. No, he's got it, man. He's got it. I'm gonna find out. Yeah. Ask my buddies from the Philippines. Sure. Get the wire from the Philippines. The Filipino wire. Or you can find out and ask him to play some. Yeah. I wonder what he's giving up, bro. I don't know, but in Domino's, I'm a beast. He don't want none. <laughs> <laughs> Tibby Wings, Domino's, Tic Tac Toe. You all got weight. There you go. Jacks. <laughs> Flyers <laughs> dice. Yeah, all that. All that. 1424. Tops. Yo yo's. <laughs> Here goes that sweet break again. See what he does this all right. time. I'm just interested in that backhand. You see, he starts forward like American style, but when he goes through, he cocks it sideways. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah. See? Wow. He's made a ball every time. Got a yeah, shot. He got a and shot. And the one. See, when he comes back, he yeah. spins this way. Yeah, he yeah. goes that way, Jeff. Yeah. He comes up and out, and then he comes right back in. He just corks it. Yeah, he right torques there. it to the side, wow. and then comes in. Jeff DeLuna style, but not as, as exaggerated, because Jeff DeLuna's all the way up in the air, and you can see it. Yeah. And then he comes down rainbow side. This guy's just up, out to the side shotgun, and then back in. At this level, almost becomes a breaking contest. That's exactly what it is. Breaks the best. Now man. you sound like Mike DeShane. That's what Mike right? changed that. Oh, if you break good, that's, you know, that's the champion. Well, then break good. Right? Uh, but these skill, pockets, right? remember, guys, these pockets are not, these are three and seven eighths inch pockets, man. Hey, hey uh, <laughs> Jeff, these pockets look like the Lincoln Tunnel right now. No. These, these guys, guys yeah. just putting them in. And we've seen people struggle on there, good shooters. These yeah. guys aren't struggling. No, they're not. And this guy looks right at home. I don't know what kind of cue he's playing with there. He's got a rapless cue, nice looking cue. Yeah, it is nice. It's clean. I like those clean style cues like that. Yeah. Got a little uh, weird angle to get to get on this four ball. You got straight in, man. Yeah. Put a little Filipino punch juice it. in Spin City. Spin the side rail. Oh yeah, now he definitely hit a short there. Wow. There you go. That's a that's a second position there he's made. Since right. He play. Hasn't missed a ball yet. Right. But the second Good only call. the second position. That's right. So now he's just gonna have to recover with his bank and hide him under the five. What do you think? He's banking his ball. He's playing safe. You may cut this motherfucker in. <laughs> Two-way shot, maybe? Good a little two-way shot. <laughs> See? Good Ron handed to the rescue, because I can't play. I'm ducking. Alex is the next out friend. Who's the next Alex? Oh, he says so, Divini. He so says what is this match here? Divini Q. Plays Oscar for the hot seat, is that right? I thought Oscar has to play Corey, no? Maybe that's what uh, it is. You're, you're probably right, Phil. I was on lunch break. Going on the far and the, the side. Side. You got that safe. spin, man. He might get a window. Might have a window. He's got a half a window. I've never seen these guys jump a ball, have they? Are they going to yeah. jump it? Is he going up in the air? He's Looks going like to. He's pulling out his right jump cue. Yeah. I don't know how guys play with watches on. I can't do it. It bothers me when I have it on. I can play with the watch on. Yeah. I don't like it. These guys are from the Philippines. He's calling the four wall. And the corner? The yeah. He hit it. <laughs> when he, he jumped it with English and it spun when he hit it. Yeah. It landed, right? Yeah. 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 
Now, what do you like here? You like just back cutting this ball in? Yeah. He back cuts it and breaks up that five eight. I think he's gonna he's gonna hold it up. I think, man. There we go. A little technical difficulty, and of course, Phil Prince has solved it. But I'm just looking at the back cut on the four and coming right at the five. Yeah. With that rounded tip, he's just, I think he's going to hold gonna, it up. He's going to hold it up and cut this ball right in. It's a hard shot to hit. You think so? Good shot yeah. Right in. Corey and Oscar, Corey Oscar, table number 19. How you like it? Tonight. Okay. Well, he don't like it. Yeah, he don't like it, and he just kicks it right in. He hit it, too. I told you he's going to cut that ball in and come hit that. You hit it right. You can call yeah. it right, Ron. And here comes the kick. Today's the Migos. Hey, D. Oh. Well, uh oh. And, it's a uh, tough shot. He left him here. Yeah, but this guy is. This yours? guy's hit some good. This guy hit some good. He's just gonna pump uh, this in. Oh yeah, you can't. They're over <laughs> here though. He's just gonna pump it in. They're over there. <laughs> He's pumps it. Dad, who you like in this match? Um, well, I just four, think four. either one of them is gonna play their hardest. But uh, I think he always liked Jeffrey. I think Jeffrey's the overall better player. That's what you think? Because yeah. I was saying, I was like, man, this Oliver guy plays pretty sport. Yeah, they all feel solid. No doubt. So I'm gonna change my vote. I told you Ignacio was better. I like the person who. Uh, who gets the rolls of that. Right. There That's you go. basically what it's going to come down to. They Absolutely. Good. I just like this guy. Ball? No, I don't this think guy so. He's playing safe. Jail City. Yeah. I think that's too soft. Too man. soft. Yeah. Oh, man. Let's just test her here. Yeah. yeah. Let's see how straight this guy shoots. I hope Jeffrey takes more than two strokes on it. Normally, he's he don't, like, he yeah. gets down, he's like, one, two, boom. <laughs> it's not yeah. even one, two. It's one and a little half or not even one. It's like a... 1.7. Yeah. <laughs> No, he's cutting this to the side. You think so? Yeah, he's going right in the side, so. Really? Yeah. I think he's, he's stop shot. He's yeah, I think he's gonna go in the corner, man. Thank you. Now he's looking at it again. He's slicing dice in the side to come back and bump that ball and get shaped. Yeah, that's what he's doing. I think he was looking to see where he wants to keep ball at. He's you know, lining up for the side. He's lining it up, he's slicing it right in. Wow, overcut it. How do you overcut that ball? I like the stop shot better. Yeah. Stop shot to the corner? Yeah. Wow. <coughs> when you guys play American pool, <laughs> what's the matter with you? <laughs> it's just Filipino pool. Filipino pool. pool. <laughs> they like side pockets. <laughs> yeah. Cut it in. This guy likes getting out. Yes, <laughs> That's what he likes. He's going to take a lead if he gets out here. Six to four. And, you know, I wish somebody was here from the Philippines to explain the stables like the... Puyad and all that stuff because I heard that there's big competition. Can explain it to you. Can explain it to He's been so much time before. Next time I get, I'm gonna Next ask him. Well. Yeah, I'll ask him because I, I know there's competition and levels. Clean hit. You know. Corey Duell and Oscar starting the match. The next table over. Man, we just—I I feel like I have a rubber neck. I'm just looking all over. There's so many great matches yeah, to see. Yeah, great. Oh. Wow, what a good shot that was. Came right around on a 10 ball. These guys keep their head down so right. well. Right, right. Oh, yeah, he's trying to talk me into making him a 7. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> not the Des. I'd like to I thank the think so. <laughs> official rack sponsor of the Mez West State Tour, the Turtle Rack. If you're interested in purchasing any, you can go to MezWestStateTour.com and receive a pack of two for only $22. This is how we do it. This is how we roll. Uh, this house is packed. There's a bunch of knowledgeable uh, spectators around. It's three deep sitting, and they're standing and yeah. kneeling, and they're just loving this action right now. Yeah, on the chat, uh, I think we had a total of 82 players. We can just ask that. 80. 80, 80 players. And the entry fee is uh, $65 for members, and there's a uh, $25 membership fee. 
Which goes to? Which goes to a Top Gun event at the end of the year. So all of the membership funds go directly back towards the players for the Top Gun tournament at the end of the season. So if you plan on playing more than one event, it's highly encouraged to get a membership. That's right. And we have, we beat our uh, current membership from last year. We already have about 30 more members already. Wow, that's, that's great. great. But it's, I'm, not, I'm not surprised. It's just uh, a testament to the skills. Yeah, we, we rate our players as 7 is like an amateur. 8 is a semi-pro, and 9 is a pro. So these guys are 9s. And here goes Mr. Ignacio. Hits him with the pop. He scrounges right inside. That's going to cost him. That is going to cost him now. That's, That's going to tie it up. Yeah. Wide open, too. Wide open, and. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. 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 Yeah
this guy's center pocket man. Yeah. Now, do you like to come just uh, one rail out, or do you like to go uh, three rails? I think it's just to come one rail straight across. Yeah. Cue ball middle of the table. Yeah. We'll play the, play the eight in the lower left corner. And go ahead, yeah. Still a test for this. It is. It's hard, hard to hold this ball. Yeah, it is. Especially on new felt. Yeah. You might just come back two rails and play the side pocket too. You know, it yeah. has a both Bustamante style of aiming yes. all the way at the bottom of the ball. Two rails right inside. Spin yeah. it right there. Beautiful. Perfect. Man, that's strong. So, is this two rails forward, Jeff? Um, well, no, he's going to juice the heck out of this ball, man. Oh, one rail. Oh, man. Force <laughs> an angle after this shot. That was a strong shot right there. And he's, this is 7 4. Oliver Mendenia, 7 4 of Jeffrey Ignacio. I'd like to thank our sponsor, Laden, Hyundai, and Subaru. Jim Laden with his son, Spencer. Ladies. Plays on tour. Laden. Thank you, Des. Layden Hyundai Subaru from Ventura. If you'd like to check out their used cars or news cars, see Jim Layden. Rodney Morris and Frank is 7 7. Frank's about to take the jump on the hill if he makes his 10 ball right now. Uh, it looks like a you know, uh, me and Frank were talking in the bathroom, and I was told him, I said, "Man, you're you're giving hope to everybody because you're you're hanging in there." I got it. Takes the lead, huh? Wow. That's yeah, strong, man. Like the older, older master saying, "You make the balls, you win. That's no matter it. who you're playing. That's right. You miss the balls, you lose. That's right. Exactly. And that's exactly what master. That's what's happening. Exactly. You make them, you win. You miss them, you know it. <laughs> <laughs> you know it. Speaking of winning, um, Oliver's over here uh, getting out when he can. Everybody goes to nine. Oh, yeah. He just gets two on the wire, so it's two next to his name. So he gets those two, goes to nine. He only needs one now. That way it's less confusing, so everybody goes to nine. All right, King Kong's getting ready to break again here, Phil. I'm going to be watching this sidearm action. Yeah, watch, watch that arm, I'm telling you. He starts in the regular, traditional. And then he, when he gets to the back swing, he cocks sideways and then turns it right back in. Yeah. Takes a lot of practice to get that dialed in, man. I would be afraid. I think I'd pop my arm, just arm right up. So. Simultaneous motion, man. Right. A lot going on at the same time. Yeah. So watch in the, in the front, we'll get a bird's eye view of it. He will stroke forward. And then when he brings it out, it's sideways. This is forward. Sideways. Three ball, and he has a shot. Makes two balls wow. again. Wow. Man, man. Nice he's up there on that one, and that, that cue ball. That's how many times did he have looking at that one? Every Almost time, every time he right? broke. Almost every time he broke, he had a good shot on the one. So, yeah, nice. something to emulate, except that little side part. I'm, I'm afraid. Break sort of like you, uh, Phil? I, I'm going to yeah. work on that sidearm. You work on that little sidearm, Greg? Yeah, I am. There you go, Big Jeff said, I'm going to sidearm it out. Go and do some more push-ups, man. <laughs> you know. I'm just happy. What a what a great weekend of, of pool this has been. And, you know, Fantastic. great for the spectators. You get to see world-class pool right here. And, like... How can you not play in a tournament where you pay $65, you get two races a nine against world-class opponents? Yeah, you strong. can't get action like that. Nope. That would be, what, 30, 
I don't need what thirty two dollars, thirty two fifty a set. It's thirty a set plus right. table time. Thirty a set plus table time. Thanks, Jeff. And I don't think anybody's giving you that. It'd be like a uh, Ignacio gonna play for thirty dollars. Thirty dollars. <laughs> Guys, is this guy's feeling his old man? He's striking that ball pure. Yes. Right through the heart. Is this gonna draw the straight up table? You know what I noticed? Does he start wow. every aiming process with his tip in the cloth? He does. He likes yeah. to draw his ball. Right. But he does it real well. Yeah. So I want to see if he follows the ball, does he start aiming in the cloth? Well, we yes, he does. Yeah. Right? He starts in the cloth and then a little short rates there. up a little bit. Yeah. yeah. He's going to go two rails tight, deep into this, this pocket. Oh, he oh, missed it. He missed the ball. And he left That's Ignacio. The ball missed yeah, between both his guys the whole That's center. right. You're right. He is the ball that was missed. Wow. Ignacio jumped out that seat. Yeah. He was he was taking a nap. Yeah. <laughs> That's right. On table two, Jason Williams is down 6-4 to Raymond Fadaon. Oscar Dominguez is up 1-0 over Corey Duell. And just like that, we just like that, we have 7-5, Oliver and Jeffrey. Is that big game? All right, we'd like to thank CSI, Q Sports International. Special shout out to Ozzy Reynolds and the crew. So I'm down there at the BCA, wonderful group of people, CSI International. Ronnie Morris and Frank Roberts. Yeah, wow. Good match. match. And contracting break styles. Ignacio with the pop. That's and wow, break. how did he hit it? Oh. He made. He would have made four balls on that break. Did he make a ball? He made a ball. Yeah. Uh huh. But the six went in the side. The four went in the corner. And the one hung in the corner. How do you like it from here? Like it. Um, this is a tough table. If we had to rate this table, this would be a. This is the kind of spot. It's the tightest table. <laughs> By far. Well, Tough action. Get, get in on the two balls, not 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 easy here, right? Well, to get between the, the four and the nine. Why didn't Broach drive the drive? Didn't leave Michelle. Yeah, I see. Well, he's going over rail. Middle table. There you go. He said, you know what? Middle table is your I friend. know I can make this ball, so let me just get to the middle, and I'm going to shoot from there. I'll take my chances. Mm. Wow. Just what a deliberate wow. stroke, man. <laughs> that was a shot right there. <laughs> what a deliberate stroke. You said, yeah, you want some? This combination is. It can be funny because you, so you, you he, don't want the three ball to leak out. Right. So he's, he's, so he's going to, I thought he's going to play the three towards the corner pocket. No, he's he's going to play, yeah, yeah that, that he might do. Right. He might follow it up. And like the three towards the corner, right? Oh. You know I, we learned something there, right? I was following you. What a play that was. Off the nine. That was so strong. That's what I love about pool, man. You know, the shots might look rudimentary and then somebody comes in. And does that yeah, something yeah. like that? You don't want to even think it. Oh, that was yeah. so strong! How strong was that? Brutal. Yeah, awesome. <laughs> he took away everything that we were talking about. He, he just said, "Okay, you know nothing. Let me show you what you're doing." <laughs> <laughs> you think you know how to play pool? Watch this. Exactly. That's what I love about pool, though. You know, there's always opportunities to learn and get better. We were in a forum recently. 
Yeah. Jess, you was in the pool room? We were in a pool room. No. Really. No way. No. I wasn't here. But there was a, there was a player, a well-known player, telling Jeffrey that one of the rails was bent out. So he couldn't, he can't make a ball on the rail. So he's telling him, he can't make a ball on the rail. And Jeffrey's like, really? And he wow. just puts it down. He, he's like, fires it in 100 miles an hour. And then, uh. I was like, yeah, but you can't make it if, it, if it's frozen. So he's like, okay, so he puts right, the ball to the rail, and he uh, fires it in like three or four right. times in a row, and he's like, and, and mm-hmm. Jack Ray goes, okay. maybe you'll know how, know how to make play pool. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> nice. <laughs> right. You are watching the Mets yeah. West State like, Tour. Maybe you know how to Stop play pool. number six at Mill Peters Edgy's Billiards with Phil P, Jeff Gregory. Ra Hannah and Desiree Rivera enjoying some masterful play here. Oliver is up seven six. Yep, he's breaking again. Breaking again. Rodney just said. Uh, Rodney just pulled out. out. Oh, Rodney just pulled out. Okay, so Rodney Morris over Frank Roberts. What a great tournament for Frank Roberts. Yeah. What a great tournament. You know, he hung in there. He did his thing. You know. That's uh, that's always good to see. I'm always rooting for the underdog. He played good. He yes, played he good all tournament. I mean, Man, to, you, to, you take a, to take day. a world champion to the case game. You better believe it. You have to yeah. be doing something right. You better believe yeah. it. Because ain't nobody giving up nothing. Right? They ain't right. giving up nothing. Nothing. Right. Oscar's it, about it, to go up 3-0 here against Corey. And it's just getting tougher. And I'm going to say it. I think the whole world sleeps on Oscar Dominguez. I think they think he's okay. And they think maybe he's, you know, strong second tier. How it possible? But there's sometimes when that guy plays ridiculous. His yeah. high gear is I'm so, really I'm sorry. high. You know, you know what I like about his game? I'll say the same about Jeff's game. He controls the game. I like the control guys. I mean, you can be flashy and run out, you know, all the time. But a guy who can control, what if you're not shooting good? Right. Then you can't win. But if you can control the game, grind it out, or you can shoot it out, you're a bad man. I like to control, control people. Ralph yeah. Suke, those guys. Yeah. And, and his cue ball control is phenomenal. Oscar can put the cue ball, you know, well, and pick, that, a, pick a spot on the yeah. table and he'll and get jump there. And jump cue, yeah. And, yeah. and his safe game suffocates you. It just, it just plays well. It does. All right. Enough to get, I'm off the soapbox. You, know, you know, Oliver took a little bit off of this break this time and, and he did not make up. the ball. Wow. Time he didn't make the ball in a while. That might be... The, the window that Ignacio needs to come in here and steal his game on this break. Yeah. They've just been trading. You you know, they break, I run out, you run out, I run out, you run out, I run out. Yeah. And now he's like, hey, I can tie this up. Yeah. It's, a huge, it's a huge game. Absolutely. Breaking to get on the hill. Yeah. You know, anytime you're breaking to get on the hill, you got to love it. Ryan and Rodney. Oh man. The, the, uh oh. The peeps. Brian Parks and Rodney Morris next up on the stream table. We had nothing but just great matches all day, fella. All day. You know, right? Right? All just, day. right. Yeah, we just sitting here. We enjoy best seat in the house. Yeah. We just gotta love it. Nasio's taking his time. Straw straight back. I don't know if he's happy with that. He made a little yeah. face. That means he just has to uh, slice this ball in. Oh, uh, screw up, screw zero. How do you like shooting this, Jeff? Do you like just holding it with a little bit of outside English? No, I like. Yeah, I just like to shoot it one rail, man. Uh, easy. Oh, he hit it. Wow, he got a little lucky there. It didn't make he gave it. a little hand signal. He was like, eh. Yeah. See, I would. I like to shoot that uh, coming above the side pocket. Yeah, that's what I would have shot it too. Yeah. But now to he's both got, right, now he's got back an angle. And forth. Now he's got yeah. an angle to get right on the side. Exactly. Now he's got perfect. Roll up. Very good. He hit it perfect. Yes, he did. <laughs> A little From draw here, or stop city? Stop, stop. A little draw. Yeah. 
very little. I don't right? see him making this in his side pocket. Okay. And play it up in the corner. You just want to be straight in on the eight. Right? He might even go two rails. No, three rails. There you Beautiful go. Shot. <laughs> That's the right shot right there. But a lot of guys have trouble hitting that with the accuracy. Yeah, he hit that ball hit it, good. Hit it good. Yes, he did. Got right through that ball. Just roll it in. Seven, okay, seven, seven, seven. We got seven up, baby. With Jeffrey breaking. To get on the hill. Nice. Wow, yeah. that's a nice, nice comeback. Break. Absolutely. Mez Professional Cues. You can check out their assortment at mezq.com. If you would like to try out the demo cues, make your way down to any of the Mez tour stops and try out any shaft that you want. Wow, ebbs and flows, huh, guys? Now Ignacio's breaking to get on the hill. You know, when it looked like he was... Uh, he was up three you know, games at one point. Yeah, yeah. Right, it was Ignacio seven to four. Just, yeah, just stayed, stayed steady. And, you know, he's fighting his way back. We got the big O over there next to the table. Uh, about to go up four to zero over Mr. Corey Duell. Wow. He's got four balls left to run, but they look they feel pretty lame nice. Desiree's looking for it. Desiree. Took a little bit off that break, and the one hung in. Everything hung. He's wide open. Wow. Oliver ran to the table. Yeah, jumped up. Yeah, he ran to the table. Well, it's a chance to go 4 0. Yeah, that's what I was saying. It's a huge. Uh, get, getting to the hill first is a big mental advantage, I think. At least Absolutely. for me personally. Yeah, you like. Yeah, being on a hill is uh, a good place to be, but sometimes people get on there to get stuck. That's true. Get past it, right? Absolutely. No. Yeah, I'm guilty too. Well, you know, this is what happens. Ta -da. goes one rail back to the floor. And just like that, Oscar Dominguez is up 4-0 over Corey Dole. Wow. Like I said, I mean, my head's on the swivel. All this great yeah. action round. We're getting ready to put another good match on 21. This is incredible. Raymond's uh, catching gear here and he's taking the lead against Jason Williams. He has up 7-4. Yeah. I mean, I thought Jason was... <laughs> You he's know, he's a giant killer, man. He's yes. coming doing it. He'd be proud of his achievement, man. Where's he at? He'd be eighth, right? If he gets knocked out now? Yeah. Nothing wrong with that. Very nice. nice field. Very nice stroke right there. Yeah. Barely hit that ball. Barely hit it. little tester here is kind of jacked up to control that cue ball. Right. Any, anytime you're jacked up, it's got to be tough. Gotta be uh, yeah. triple tough. Way tougher. He gets up again for the second time off that shot. He doesn't he's, like it. He doesn't, he doesn't like it. Like it. Exactly. Well, the seven, eight. We haven't seen him give think, off any ball. I think he's going to come back across the side of rail. He's going to jack this ball hard. Nope. Changes mind. Oh, wow. He, got, he hit pretty good. Yeah. He hit that good. He got a little love bump. Sure did. You know? Wow. Uh, <laughs> he used every part of that pocket. Yeah, he, yeah. uh, 
he didn't hit it super clean, and he, you know, he was uh, talking to himself a little bit there. Yeah, it's one of the first balls he did that with. Right. But the other ones, they going right CP. Yes, sir. Oh, he uh, he looked, back a little bit. I think he's yeah. still a little pressure, man. Yeah. I he's gonna play it right. in the corner though. Yeah. He's okay. I think he is now. He wasn't playing it. He wasn't playing it. Sure was yeah, he's got to play in the corner now. Man, it's like the worst. worst with this guy's with this guy's stroke that he shot this whole match. See how he stays down on the ball here. Nice shot. Um, like He's not out the woods yet. I like his chances. Yeah. <laughs> if I was a gambling man, I'd say he's out. That's his break on there. Wow. He drills that ball, and now he's breaking on the hill. Solid. I'd like to Solid. thank our platinum sponsor, West State Billiard Supplies. If you're looking for diamond tables, looking for new cloth for your tables, looking for video games and accessories for your man cave. Game rooms, pokers, Game rooms, darts, cloth, shuffleboard, chairs. The you best products at the best prices. West State Billiard Supplies. It's funny how I notice which pros talk to the crowd and which don't. Curry's a talker. Yeah, yeah. Well, that. Well, just, just watch from the world. Oliver's taking his time with the rack here because this is a huge, huge game. Yeah. And he's, you know, he's sticking it to Jeffrey a little bit. So you got to sweat it. And Jeffrey did nothing wrong except break back. Mm -hmm. Is he calling this ball? And he made, he made it. it. Oh, rolled out last second. Wow. Wow. You're right, Oliver is taking a long time. Last time he didn't make a ball on the break. Balls aren't freezing up quite right. I think that plastic uh, turtle axe started getting stretched out a little right. bit. Well, he has a choice. He can, he can trade it and get another one. Oh, yeah. Take this little time out and uh Is this where the action is? These guys right here in front of us? Yeah, here. Yeah. I'm gonna get a this is the on the air sign. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Thank you. Yeah. All right. While we have a break in the action, bring you the Rogues crew. Here we go. This is our uh, Phil Prentice. Hello guys. James Harris. Slide on in there, Big Greg. Jeff Gregory. We're doing it here real live. That's it. And in behind we have the legendary Ernesto Dominguez and Jazz. All right, so they brought a new turtle rack, and uh, we're back in business.
my friend, when I do this to the rack, he say, what are you looking for, Indians? Who said that? <laughs> my man, Skip Miller. Every time I stand out over those balls and I'm trying to rack them, and I, and I look and I'm looking, he said, what are you looking for, Indians? <laughs> <laughs> Skip, man. Yeah, <laughs> Skip, man. He's a good Skip? guy. You remember Skip? Hell oh, yeah. Yeah, he's a good guy. Got a good crew down at the uh, pool hall where I play in Plus Pocket in Northridge. You got uh, nice. Howard Bell, uh, Skip Miller, Aaron Estrada, uh, a bunch of other clowns. We have a good time. You that's know, awesome, Ernesto man. does the table, so we, we have the best of both worlds down there. Oh, we have all the Sardos. What's your tone table? Uh, Plus pocket. Plus pocket, Northridge, yeah. I played at a place called Eddie's Classic Billiards in Stockton, California. We got two Gold Crown Fives that got set up tight pockets, draw pockets. They play pretty good. Good lighting, good pizza. There you go. Still around? Yeah. yeah. Oh, he didn't hit that ball where he wanted. He didn't hit him very square, but he got he got rewarded. Me three balls in the break. And a shot in the one, man. Wow, this might be it. <laughs> that could be all she wrote, huh? <laughs> this could be, see you later, baby, bye-bye. Straight in on, how many times has this guy been straight in on a one ball? Most of his breaks. Most of his break. One break. One break, exactly. One break where he did it when he wasn't. The rest of his times, he is on it. Well, here we go. He just has to navigate these last walls. That natural uh, position yeah. here. Huh? And he will be out. You don't like it. Yeah, he's, he's fidgeting. He wanted to be closer to the rail with the cube, I think. Well, he's looking at his return angle, those that those two rails right there. He's, he's thinking, uh, I got to get over there for the four. can stop the ball right here, right? Just roll it, stop it, yeah, you're right. He's jacking up. I don't know why he's doing that. I don't know. He's going to punch it over to the rail. I don't like it. I don't know. Hit it good. Man. When this guy makes up his mind to hit the ball, he hits him clean. Yes. This might be his toughest shot. Right, six to seven. Six to seven, this is it. Gonna draw above the side pocket. Uh oh, how do you hit it? Uh oh, a little trouble. A little trouble. Wow, that's position air number three. Yeah, he doesn't, man. He doesn't want. It's a bad that time genie to, do that. to get out the bottle. It's a really bad time to do that. Well, he's gonna, right. I think he's going to come three rails and put this cue ball behind the nine ball if he can. He's going to hit the, the left side of the seven can ball. He, can he stretch? I don't know if he likes that shot. I think he sells out. I think that's a shot. No, no, hit, this, hit the left side of the left seven. Left side of the seven to come down table? Yeah. Well, whatever he's going to do, he doesn't like it. This is the shot, man. He's going to go three rails. Try and get below the nine ball. Yeah, this is the right shot. You get a good speed. Nice shot. Good call, Craig. Good call. Very Knowledgeable good crowd says good shot. But Hard to execute that with the right speed. Yeah. He's kicking this ball here. This this might be it. I think a lot of distance here. I think he's gonna bring that seven right back downtown. He's gonna come with some magic here. That's a checkmate, man. This is you right. Two this is two tough. rails, two rails. 
and he's gonna step. Just as he's gonna get safe on it, see what he does. Two rails, Imagine. stick and pray. Two rails, right in, dead perfect, and out. Nope. Okay. Get your shot. Okay. Well, you know, as a tough shot. That's so strong. Don't let him see that cue ball. Yeah, he, he put that ball right under that nine. That was a great shot. I don't know. It looks a little, <laughs> looks a little sketchy on that one leg. <laughs> he probably practice walking around one foot. He probably does. Yeah. Great memory, Jason. Yeah. Nine to four. Yeah. Jason Williams defeated by Raymond Battle on the Farrell. Nine four. There it is. Nice, nice shooting, Oliver. No concession by uh, uh, Mr. Ignacio. He says, shoot it, baby. Every dollar counts. There you go. And there we go. Nice. As a score. Nine. Nine eight. Oh, Good match. Good match. Good match. Oliver Mendit, wow, nice. That was a great match. That's what I like to see. That's, that's good stuff right there.